Fashion in the Middle Ages by Margaret Scott. So there's three main chapters and it tells you what's in them. And I found this really interesting for those who are into history, more of um, either fashion or of the Middle Ages, because it does give primary sources, like image-wise, and then goes into the description of these pieces, meaning of them, and like colors and like, and it goes into different classes and all this other stuff. So, if you have an interest in Middle Ages fashion class or like history of class or whatever, this could be a book that can be a tie in for you. So it's about clothing, so um, yeah, so it has a glossary of like fabric terms and it gives suggestions of further readings. So you do get pictures, again, you do get pictures of the article of clothing, whether it's a bit of fabric or the clothing as a whole, or you get some sort of primary image, like a piece of artwork or um, a page out of a book. So you get like a history timeline of the fabrics and clothing choices during the Middle Ages and again class-wise like church, the rich, working class, so on. And it's not country specific so you do get few clothing choices from not just Britain and other places in Europe and it's not year specific as well so you get you do get like say France in the number of years and this, it describes the fabric that is showing and you get to some other information as well and for the further reading it's uh, you do get a few books and online resources as well so you get the physical and digital references as well so and like for me the middle ages isn't my time period but for a lot of people it is so this Book can be in addition on to it if you are wanting that day-to-day -day kind of thing and so fashion is a day-to-day -day type of thing so this can and it gives primary sources as well so this could be a good use if writing like an essay or, or something so fashion in the middle ages by Margaret Scott. Happy readings.